Hello everybody, welcome back to the episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and doing another deleted run. We're doing a lot right now. We're on a minus nine streak on our regular save file here, which isn't great. Uh, we're doing Morris, start with a D14, a six room charge pocket item, which corrupts one room only. Um, so, kind of intriguing, a little bit different. We can't corrupt as much things, but um, it does start doubly charged, which is useful. And we do start with some better stats as well here, although slightly worse speed. Um, but it means we can corrupt a little bit more and see what we can get out of corrupting some extra stuff, which we do not mind at all. We'll see what we can get out of that. I want to... There's a way that I can get the minimap to be small and get the timers to go away. And I can never remember what the, what the hell it is. It really annoys me that I can't remember it. I think I need to change my minimap API settings. That was a good hit, sir. Right, um, maybe I can do it now. If I go minimap API, map one, nerds. I don't know how to do it. I don't know. I don't know how to do it. Right, anyways, let's come in here. Tough love, I think I'll just take. I don't think that's worth a corruption. It's a very good item. Especially as, as our luck increases. I think you only need 10 luck to get permanent teeth, I think. 9 luck. Not, it's not that high. Ooh, I like the way we've got like little teal coloured teeth when we fire them. It's cool looking. Just rid of dollar dollar there, thank you. Take that as well. I, I realise this is kind of a regular run so far, but I'm not going to corrupt things that are actually like good to pick up when we've got limited amounts of corruptions. I'm only going to corrupt things that are, uh, that are stuff I, I, I'd rather not take. We'll see what our boss item puts forth to us here and see if that ends up being the case. Okay, teeth shots are doing good here. Gotta be a little careful. I'm glad he's back inside there, because he's a lot more difficult when he's uh, in the first phase of his existence. Definitely some more HP, so if I get HP, I think I'll take that as well. That's not good HP, though, so I will corrupt it. Um, each kill, use gravity. Um, yeah, we'll take that. Right, let's keep it going. Keep it going. So, pretty decent run so far in terms of stats. I think the teeth plus the uh, extra fire rate is good. And the gravity thing on each kill is it's kind of a weird one. I don't know if it's good. Okay, you are lemon partying it up quite heavily, my guy. We do not want that much of a lemon party. God, it's funny how, like, there's so many references in Isaac that players nowadays just won't even know about. Like, do, do the vast majority of people, like, know where Shoop de Whoop comes from? And do do people know where Lemon Party comes from and stuff? Like, there's, there's a bunch of old references to, like, old internet memes in Isaac that I feel like so many people just won't even get now. And, like, it, for some of them, if you don't know, you, you, you're probably better off and you don't want to know. <laughs> cool. What, what we got in here? This is definitely one that we can corrupt. Uh, yes, 111 grab bags on a boss kill seems pretty goddamn useful, I'd say. Kind of, yeah, it holds our tears in the air once we kill an enemy. Which for the most part, isn't that bad. That needs to get some more HP, though. I'm hoping the grab bags might help us solve that. They can have hearts in them, so... There's a chance we get, like, a blended heart or something. Ooh, there's some weird stuff at the end of a room with our tears. Kind of glitches out and, like, holds in, <laughs> holds in one spot. As for the question of the day, really simple one. What's your favourite colour? Mine's always been, like, purple, but, like, a darker purple. I always think purple's a really nice colour. Goes with a lot of stuff. Well, that's rather nice. We can go and check out our shop. 
Yeah, I've always, I've always really, really, really liked purple. Do you know what? I'm going to quickly do this room over here first and try and get a charge for our D14 first. Just in case the shop contains something I want to change. Here's some HP potentially. There you go, baby. We've been waiting for. Okay, it's actually kind of nice when we kill an enemy and they fire and it holds their tears in the air. I like that. Extra key. We'll check out the boss first here. Don't think I'm going to go devil deal at this case. Seems to be glitching when I fire a teeth shot. The tooth shots seem to be a little bit buggy. But yeah, I'm hoping I can get some good luck upgrades down the road just to make our teeth shots even more common. Because they are very strong. Three times damage. Oh, we got a golden one in there as well. Beautiful. Beautiful. We got a token in there. If we grab that and then token, we get another golden one. Awesome. Okay, well, this is good stuff. I think I will just take that. Beautiful stuff there. Beautiful stuff. Judgment, you can go there. Okay. The the, the 11 grab bags on boss kill thing is, is pretty goddamn good. Pretty goddamn good. I reckon we're going to get quite a lot out of that throughout the course of this run. Right. Boss. Not boss time. Shop time. We can also go into this secret room here. I should have known was there, to be honest. But I don't think I had the bombs at the time. Now I've got golden bombs and a bunch of other stuff as well. More grab bags. Yeah, grab bags can have, like, shit in them sometimes like that. Like, two pennies. But sometimes, they got some real good stuff on them. And we'll corrupt this and see what we get. Um, each arcade, 4% chance to get tears. 60% chance to minus 4.8 damage. That is way too risky. That would put our damage into, like, the negatives. Which I don't even know how that would work. But it would be bad. <laughs> I'm guessing it just set it to 0 0.1 or something. I don't actually know what minimum damage is. I'm gonna guess it's 0 0.1. But yeah, either way, I think it's probably a bad idea that we take that, uh, just in case. And we'll just keep moving on. I think we've got a battery charge in here anyway, so we can recharge for the next floor. That we do. Lovely stuff. Okay. And away we go. I think we've set ourselves up for some decent success here. And hopefully we can corrupt another few things into some beautiful stuff. And we can not take too much damage in the process like I currently am. Dude, these little... These, these guys are dicks. Oh my god, stop with the bubbles, man. It's too much. Too many bubbles. Holy hell. Chill the hell out. Just die. Enemies are ruthless. They should never stop. That's the sack for us. Lovely. Right, grab that. Another pretty worthless sack there. We'll go straight for our boss here, I think. While we've got the charge for our D14 in case we get a bad boss item. And to get all the sacks rolling as well. Stain isn't too bad in his new form. He's not changed too much, to be fair. He's pretty... Pretty much like he used to be. With a few new attacks. Slightly tweaked AI. Don't know why I threw a bomb down there. It hit him. I really didn't think that was going to hit him. Uh, we do have a trinket right now, but I think I want to take that anyways. Three of spades. I'm just going to take it anyways. I realise it's not going to gulp down a trinket that we don't have, but still. Right. Item room. Back we go. Yeah, the the, the 11 sacks is, is, is truly pretty amazing. Never gonna have need for keys or anything ever again. That one died so fast compared to the other one. What the hell? In here we got Pop Pop, which is pretty goddamn good. I think I'll just take Pop Pop. And then here we've got Sculpting clear, which is, of course, also really, really good. 
We'll take Sculpting Clay as well. Okay. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to use Sculpting Clay on now. We can just go to the next floor without using it, which is a bit of a shame. But it's good to have. It means we can get... Basically, it means we can take an item and corrupt it at the same time. Which is really, really nice. It's going to lead to some shenanigans, I'm sure. Um, I think I'm just going to corrupt that. It's not very good, but there you go. We'll take it. Oh, you've got soy milk, dear. Oh, I forgot we had pop pop. Ooh. Empty vessel. Very, very good. Yeah, pop pop can do some wild stuff. Oh, God, for God's sake, my guy. Just get real. Good, good. Beautiful. That counts as a boss as well. Very nice. Some battery charges in here. Lovely. So we can do that. Oh, I got tears down out of that pill. God damn it. Right. Keep this rolling. But yeah, I kind of forget that like... The, the 11 stacks on boss kill counts for any boss, not just the boss room boss. So there's going to be some rooms later down the line where we get an overwhelming amount of sacks. <laughs> like a truly, truly overwhelming amount. We find a Larry Jr. Things are, things are going to go off the rails real fast. <laughs> things are going to get a bit spicy in that scenario. Oh dude, the fucking mini mushrooms keep getting me. Stop. Back it off. All good. Right, easy kill on you. That tier kind of snuck by though, didn't it? Once again, a bunch of annoying enemies. By a bunch, I mean fucking thousands of them. God damn it. Just use Pop Pop to annihilate. Dude, if one of these guys hits me again, I swear to God I'm going to throw down. <laughs> Ooh, Eve's Mascara. Yes, please, I'll take that. Thank you. I think I can take it twice, actually. I might just take it twice and see what happens. Nothing. You bastard. I really thought it would... I really thought that would help. Get off my pennies. Okay. Pop, pop. Doing some good stuff for us. Killing enemies quickly. Keep it going. Easily demolishing everything right now. Not really got too much corruption going on yet. It's still a little bit lackluster in terms of the corrupted game, but all it takes is like one crazy item. And we've, we've had some crazy ones so far. I mean, the sack one is, is, is pretty goddamn useful, you got to admit. It's not crazy, but good. See, this, this is what I was just about to say about things getting wild. It's getting slightly unmanageable now. How are you still alive? There you go. Finally got some golden bombs in there. Right, well that's, that's all that done. I um, think I'll take the HP, thank you. Angel deal, what do you hold for me? Ah, great. These chests. 
That's probably pretty useful to just take. I know I've, I'm, I'm pussing out on a lot of these, but... I think it's okay. Don't take the money anymore, we've got plenty of money. We've got plenty of everything, to be honest. Ah, really? I can't remember if, uh, if killing this guy will be useful to us or not. I wonder if I can corrupt the key. I can. I summon nine big on hands instead of dying once spawn twelve times around the monsters. This might have been a mistake. At least we have Herming for the room. Okay. Let's get out of here. <laughs> right. What on earth is going on in this room, then? Let's try and do what we can to, to get rid of all the stuff we can get rid of. And make sense of the stuff that we can actually pick up. And utilize. There's still so many sacks left. Right. We're 99 on everything now. Kind of expected that to come along, but... Came along a bit sooner than I thought. We've got a golden battery in here as well. This gets to the point where we're sorting out between all the cards. Because there'll be some cards in here that are actually useful to us. Just trying to get to that point, because there's still so many keys and pennies and stuff about, and I've just spawned more pennies. I really don't need any more game. I really don't. Okay, I think we're at the point now where we can chill out and look through things. So what we got here? Nope. Um, sun. Pop it. Strength. Pop it. Empress. Pop it. Pop it. Doubles the number of coins. Just pop it. Pop. 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 Uh, justice again. Pop. We need a better active item. Judgment, pop you there. Probably just pay you out, to be honest. Give me a health upgrade, hopefully. I could probably corrupt it, actually. Yeah, let's corrupt it and see what we get. Delete that. Well, four times trinkets. Interesting. 2.5% chance to spawn a special spectral tier, which teleports to en enemies to different locations in the room. Tinted rocks. 2% um, chance of firing a tier. Let the spawn a rift on impact would be controllable. Sounds good. I think I'll take that. World. The world. Pop it. Lovers. High Priestess. Lose all of your bombs. Oh, this, this could be intriguing. This could be intriguing. That was terrible. Okay, that wasn't all of our bombs. That was 33 bombs. Okay. I, at first I thought that was actually all of our bombs. I was going to be like, excuse me, no. <laughs> Right, what else we got going on here? Worship. Yeah, I'll take that, thank you. I think we're gonna probably hold on to the sun card and go, aren't we? Cool. We're ready? We're ready. Yeah, I knew we were gonna get to a wild point with those sacks. I knew it was coming. Sun card, just for seeing where we're going. And we got one of those controllable tiers instantly as well. Trinket already paying off. Controllable tier that spawns a rift on impact is kind of nice. I like the idea. But plenty of bombs to work with. Plenty of everything to work with now, so... HP up. Okay, HP has now reached the point where I'm actually re reasonably happy with it, so that's good. Don't need to pick up keys, game. Why do I keep doing that? We've also still got Pop Pop that I need to be utilising as well. I kind of forgot about that for a hot second. We just spent quite a while sifting through random shit, so... I kind of forgot what we have and what we don't have. Ow. 
Okay, we are killing stuff very, very quickly. Swindler is is probably something that I'll take, so I'll do that with him, and then I'll corrupt him. The careful friendly. Every four rooms spawn three times shop items upon. Uh, oh yeah, okay, I like that. Ow, that was a great way to enter a room. Thanks, game. Why'd I shoot you? Right, Swindler, you can take all that. We don't need the money. Do it as slowly as you can, though, man. As slowly as you can. Oh, we have Brimstone for some reason? No, just for that room, okay. Okay, these guys are taking their sweet time to get out of here. Get out of your skull, my guy. Get out of your skull. Right, what we got going on in the shop? Unused toggle to coin firing. Each bullet costs one cent to fire when hitting a wall. There's a chance to drop fading coins. Killing enemies with a crowd funder may also drop extra money. I think I'm just going to grab that and go for this. Cool. Okay, we spawned some boss items in there as well. Our luck has only gone up one point so far, so teeth shots are not galore yet, but we'll get there. We'll get there. And boss time. Hey, I'm liking this. Oh, Trisagian, there you go. I think it's only temporary though, isn't it? We don't uh, we don't get it permanently, yeah. It's only temporary. Get more sacks coming in. Not quite the amount of last floor, but still more coming in. There you go. Right, you, you have all the money, my good friend. You have all the money. We don't need it. We'll grab the credit card here. So why not? I will corrupt this if I can. I'll take Stigmata. I'm doing this just for the charge, by the way. Yeah, we've got a lot of items for sale now to end up purchasing, which is kind of interesting. The Swindler and this other thing. Also, the sacks are good. I could have corrupted that item as well with the charges in here, to be honest. Remove this. Give that a go. Right. Oh, where were you? It's getting slightly more wacky by the minute. Slightly more wacky by the minute. A bunch of double bombs, thank you. Not that we needed them, but I'll take them. Uh, not exactly what I'm looking for, but thank you. Bloody buggers. Ah. Didn't want the devil card. God damn it. Don't, don't spawn stuff in ways where I instantly buy it by accident. Oh, hello. Oh. I picked up an item I didn't mean to pick up there. I'll take that. Grab a version of that for me, thank you. I really like having modeling clear in this scenario. It means we can have an item that we don't leave behind. It's good. Right, there you go, Swindler. He's so slow at picking stuff up. <laughs> I wish he'd just, like, when he hovered over them, it automatically pick it up. But he isn't that smart. Hope we got Brimstone this room again. Still don't really know where we're getting the Brimstone from. But I'll take it. Another one cent card, thank you. I should be picking those up in case they're, like, really good. Or in case they're that. The Hanged Man. Another bunch of stuff in here. Baby battery. Oh, I didn't realize this was Mum. Shouldn't have gone this far. My bad. Oh, God. The rage mode is incoming.
Oh, that's a bunch of sacks, baby. That's quite a few sacks, baby. Lots of troll bombs in those sacks as well. Right. Anything else we can do in here? I think we quickly go like this and go boom, boom. Got lucky with that one, and then I'll corrupt the other. Why not? Right, I think we are good to go. Yeah, haven't got anything absolutely crazy, but this is this has got some some wild intentions. Still only on one look, unfortunately. That's a good one to curse. Oh, just straight up free will earn here. Thank you. I'll take that. Nope. What? Wh where the fuck did that hermit card come from? That wasn't in my inventory when I pressed Q. <laughs> Take, take me back to where I came from, please. Don't spawn another child. That's just annoying. What are you spawning now? Another one? Okay, I'll do that one this time. On hit spawn, nine coins seems useful. Right. Keep it moving. Swindler's going to be having an absolute party. A battery? You know that's not what I wanted. Give me more items and charges. Dude, this guy is going to go book fucking wild. I just wish he was quicker. And he has such a weird order of picking things up as well sometimes. Like, yeah, wh why is he... Ugh. Does he pick them up in the order of when they spawned or something? Either way, he's 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 charged to the gills now. He has plenty of fuel. Take like that, thank you. Bunch of forks. I like it. It's not what I meant to do. Uh, I, I don't even know where that item came from. Okay, it's over here. I didn't see that. Delete that. Delete this. Okay. Okay, this has just gotten weird. <laughs> it's really hard to keep track of what the hell's going on, to be honest. This is another one we're going to get a lot of sacks. Yet another sack-filled adventure. I know what's going on with those bombs there. They're doing their thing. I'm still invincible as well. Okay, just trying to get a bit more money. We keep getting more and more versions of this item. Soul of Eden, I didn't even think about the fact that it would reroll everything. Take that. Got <laughs> some mortal hearts going on here, what the fuck is going on? I keep getting Red Bomber, I've got Cursed Eye in the mix as well apparently. Okay, let's, let's go to the next floor, I don't know what's going on. Okay, apparently I have permanent cursed eyes right now. Oh no, is it, that's that's not cursed eye, I don't think. Remove. Remove this. 
Okay, we've got some saw blades as tears now. Don't mind that. It's very glitchy. Thank you for Papa Fly. Thank you for Red Bomber. Not that we don't have a billion of those already, apparently. Okay, the saw blades are, are very, very glitched. We'll take that as well. Why not? God damn. This really got off the rails very, very quickly, didn't it? Very, very quickly. I barely know what's happening. Okay, whenever enemies fire, they just fire at themselves. That's kind of nice. Effigy? Why not? There's our eternal chests. Forgot about them. Ooh, flight is good. We'll take flight. Uh, Dark Judas as a revive is probably pretty good. We'll corrupt the other two. Okay. Fuck me, man. <laughs> How do we even keep track of all this nonsense? Effigy doing its thing. <laughs> what are all my spiky block boys doing? Oh, dude. Oh, we got we got so many of these fork items. The the reverse. Um, it's the tainted version of Spoonbender. That, like, literally, they, they seem to stack and every single one of them just means that you can never fire a tear. It all just comes straight back at you. Camo undies seems pretty good. Why can't I... Okay, every time I pick up something, I, I pull out a flame now. That's not ideal. Okay. I guess I'll take that for a hit. We've got tank boys as well under there. I don't know why. <laughs> I just don't know why. Card reading. Okay, some rooms are just dying at the moment we walk in them. Oh, dude, the amount of spiky blocks. Holy shit, I've never seen, I've never had more than one. I didn't realize they're all attached to the same rock. That's cool. I wonder if that's just because there's one rock in this room or if they'd normally do that too. Yeah, the spiky blocks are just so bad. <laughs> I have no idea what's going on. Got some holy water in here. I'll take a holy water. Man. <laughs> Ooh, Emperor. I think we should probably take that. No spiky blocks this time because there just isn't any to attach to. Oh, I, th I think it's the spiky blocks are actually controlled by me. I didn't realize that. Yeah, they are controlled by me. I never knew that. I always thought they did their own thing. I double tapped to, to, to dash them around the room. Right. Four chests here. Four corrupted items, I think. No boss room teleport. I'll take Strange Apple as well. Okay. I don't know where that came from. Corpse Flower. I'm just taking everything now. I don't care if it breaks the game. Oh my god, so many items. I don't like whatever's giving me blue candle, because I can't pick stuff up when I'm holding blue candle above my head. It's a pain in the ass. I think it's whenever I pick up a key. Yeah, it is. It's whenever I pick up a key. But avoid keys at all costs. Don't know where the bombs come from either. That's a bit of a mystery. I'm also getting invincibility as well, which means I can't even fire the blue candle. Look at this. I want to fire the blue candle, but I can't. Get out of my hands, blue candle.
Oh my god, look at all the spikies. This is insanity. Well, there's fucking chairs everywhere. Am I still firing saw blades? Where'd the saw blades go? I wish my bombs are pretty wild now, aren't they? Alright, here's the boss. Holy shit, it called in so many! So many plums! The fuck happened? I barely know what's happening right now. Whoa, 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 our shots have become amazing. Where am I? Where's the boss? Where's anything? There's too much crap in this room. <laughs> oh, man. That was something else. I hope you guys enjoyed that one. That was crazy. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.